Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. decorated a kickboxer as has come into this division in some time, DC. And if we get a kickboxing match tonight, he ain't losing. He is a championship-level kickboxer, a guy that can stand in the pocket and trade and kick and punch with anyone. He's constantly throwing things from as close as you can get. He's comfortable throwing leg kicks. He will drive these into your body. But it's the aggressiveness and the ability and willingness to stand in the pocket and trade that makes him truly, truly special. I think that is what separates kickboxing, the high level yeah. from everyone else. He understands distance as well as any striker in this division. Of course, that is a byproduct of a lifetime of repetitions in the kickboxing space. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes. would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this highly anticipated welterweight fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters and they both possess a similar height and reach. Now for the introductions, here is Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the Octagon, Eve Loving. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Welterweight Division. It's who does he first? Fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet eight inches tall, weighing in at 156 pounds, fighting out of Tempe, Arizona, USA, fast. And now to see his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to power. Tonight, though, he draws a guy who can do a little bit of everything. And that guy is usually the one that will have the advantage. But we know what a high-level striker is, and this guy is as high-level as we've ever seen in the UFC. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Just missed on the front kick there. Oh, nice job to get the guard up there as the strike is blocked by Lee. Let's get going now. Get off first. Get over and over, he landed a big body kick. Andy lands the knee to the body now. 
I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Straight right hand now just misses. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh! Head kick! Oh! Oh, straight right! Just a split there. Missed with that attempt. with the right hand. Oh, big punch land. Protect your face. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Lee gets hit by that kick to the body. No good. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, that's gonna soften him up. Massive knee to the body. Cable's inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. And he landed the right hand there. Beautiful strike. Lee gets absolutely pelted by that head kick. And that one certainly found the target. Take more of these leg kicks, you will not be able to be very active on your feet. Nice leg kick. A nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind the blow up. Round two is next. All right, that horn marks the end of the round. There was a lot to like, really, on both sides, but particularly that Superman punch, an absolute thing of beauty. Beautiful attack. Her ability to let loose in the octagon is truly a sight to behold. Not many people are willing to try something so risky. All right, DC, second round is getting underway. Round one, not the round of the year necessarily, but some good in there. And it's not always gonna be. You have these very talented fighters. Sometimes it's very even. That's what we saw in the last one. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Nice leg kick there by Lee. Block that kick to the body. Oh, just misses with the kick. Oh, this fight's gonna be over. What a great way of mixing.
messing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Such a fast leg kick. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, <laughs> if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Trying to establish that jab once again. Lee gets caught with that punch. There's no tell on that leg kick. Nice. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Just over three minutes to go now. Oh, Superman punch. Not always easy to execute. He did so there. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. Big kick lands. Oh, big roundhouse attempt, but unable to land. Straight punch lands. And both guys really throwing with authority. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. Flicks the guard, lands the right hand. Unable to connect with the right. Oh. Big kick land. Came with inches right there, Damn. boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Man, look at that damage on the right side of his body. Starting to really bruise now. Well, as my favorite rap group Onyx would say, stick and move. Right? Huh. Beautiful slip off the center line there. Yeah, what a great job of How's his opponent still standing? This fight is supposed to be over. It might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. All right, so he postures up here and now figures to rain down some ground strikes. Yeah, the ground and pound will be a plenty from this position. Oh, really nice work to keep busy off of his back as he lands some more offense here from Bob. He's attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. Both fighters back to their feet now. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Got to be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Oh, nice. Oh, both. Both landed. Oh, how about that? He lands a huge kick. Seconds remain in the round. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging then when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. All right, 
Pretty good back and forth action in the previous two rounds. Your expectations here as this next round gets I expect the action to really pick up now. These guys have to lay it on the line as we start to approach the end of the fight. Nice job of hiding that head kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Well, just as he did the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be, and if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Punch over the top. Lee gets tagged by that straight punch. Nice land for the offense there. Damaging punch there. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finishes. Nice punch there. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. He's grabbing the back of the head, pulling forward on the head, and then landing those beautiful punches. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile. Whoa! Stu's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a controlled posture on the bottom. And if you're the top guy, the guy that's looking to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes on your opponent. Oh, lands with the ground and pound strike. Keep it busy here off of his back. Nice offense from the bottom. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Well, he gets up again here, but he looks hurt. Oh, knee strike right to the bottom. Down landing clear. Able to check the high kick. Oh! sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Nice job to land the kick to the body there by Lee. Good defense to block the strike coming back. Right punches there. Oh, looks like he might have been in range, but misses with the kick. I might let you kick the inside of my leg after the show. No. See how that feels. You don't want that, J.A. You do not want that. No one wants that. Even trained professional fighters right. can't take too many of those strikes. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony. Always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. 
Oh, that's a good right hand. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship round. All right, well, that's the end of the round, so the location is okay, the cut on the cheek, but that is some serious blood trickling out of that cut there. You gotta think maybe at some point they call the doctor in, and if he doesn't like what he sees, maybe they stop this fight. All right, so a high-level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you gotta think the knockdown is gonna be featured prominently here. He thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin. But he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Try to establish that jab. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick you get. Not much time, but too high. And now he's got him hurt bad. There's the kick, it's blocked. How about that chin? Lee's all sorts of bruised up on his body. That is gonna hurt something fierce tomorrow. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Nice kick. Counters now left hook to the head lands. Oh, nice job with the knee strike there. That'll wake you up. He thought it would be available. He just knew he had to find the right time to throw it. That was the right time. Big head kick! Right hook to the head blocked. Trying to kick the leg out. Under three minutes now to go in the round. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Pinpoint accuracy on that kick. No wind up, no tell, just a brutal kick. Once you get take that many kicks, it doesn't matter if they're hard or not. Those are a lot of kicks. Nice leg kick lands. Good punch lands. hurt here. You can even see him limping a little bit. Oh! He's out! Oh, my goodness! What a fight! Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighters saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. All right, let's take a look back at the replay. It ends up a knockout, but this was really a striking clinic from the moment they touched glove. I mean, a competitive fight that one guy finally found the shot that ended the fight. But both of these warriors, 
displayed a ton of heart. One guy got the finish, but neither guy should be disappointed in their performance. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine is going to stop in this contest at three minutes, 35 seconds of round number four. To play the winner by... And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be like for a professional athlete, right? I know you enjoy the birth of your kids, right? Yeah. But you knock out a man in a cage fight, I can't think of anything better. I mean, there's nothing like it. You know, you don't even hear the one that lands that puts out your opponent's lights. And tonight, he got that done. And he should be very proud 